Oh, it's off the... Oh, wow, that is pretty. That looks literally like a village. This village. Like, a minute away. It feels like I'm home. Oh, I failed. I normally get any bonus points, am I? Life is pain. I did not even think that they would try to... Uh, it sounds obvious once I read it. Oh, well. Ooh, new day. The 7th of September. Oh, God. September 7th, 604. I'd be totally asleep right now. <gasps> wow. Ooh, Van, that is sick. Can we drive it? I know we won't be able to, but please let us drive the truck it. truck is huge. Well, thank you. Oh, yeah. She's a big girl. <laughs> That's a dope looking car. Again, they're so much nicer than the Erebonia cars, I must admit. Inga Nightbreaker pickup truck. Ooh. Of the four big car manufacturers in Calvert, Ingert's got the best rep when it comes to sports cars. This here's the best one they ever made. And I went ham tuning her up even further. <laughs> you can see Sorry. what I mean at the front and in the suspension system where I've... Um... <laughs> we don't care, Van, but I do. Well, respect. I can't follow a word you're saying, but it sure looks nice. He's got a nice color of blue. Do you feel they're exactly like me with cars? You know, uh, should know you wouldn't be able to appreciate a man's one true love. You want to tell me why women only want to date guys with rides, but don't want to hear a word about said rides? Man. <laughs> Careful painting all women with that excessively large brush you've got. <laughs> Even if it's true that I don't care about cars at all. <laughs> You're failing with Annie, I'm afraid. Well, whatever tuning is, I'm sure it's made your truck look very cool. Ah, just get in and be quiet before you make me cry. <laughs> What's all this whining first thing in the morning? Oh, God, it's Papa. Yeah, we kind of woke them up, didn't we? Oh, poor Yumi. Oh, you're the kind of... Yumi, you're right. I don't think you should... You should probably go back up, my darling. You you do not seem right. <laughs> you're the kind of people who gave me food yesterday. Hey, guys. Did you really come all the way out here just to see us off? Mm, yeah. Like, respect, though, for getting up Mostly at sea. Mostly for on, yes. <laughs> and fairy, but... And two, I guess. Aw, cheers. Aw, I heard that. <laughs> we also wanted to bring you this. It's got sandwiches, milk, and coffee. I'm sure you haven't had much time for breakfast this morning. These are the best landlords you could possibly ask for. My God. Nice, thanks. Oh, you really shouldn't have. Thank you so much. And after you did so much for me yesterday, too. I really don't know how to thank you. <laughs> oh, think nothing of it. Making a guest feel welcome is what a good host does. You would do the same in your home too, wouldn't you? Yep, hundred percent. Well, we already know I'm a douche. We've already discussed this part. Of course. Kids your age gotta eat a lot to grow up big and strong. Mm. Keep an eye on them both. All right, Van. Yes, yes. We'll do. And thanks for coming to see us off, Yums. <laughs> Have a safe trip. Oh god, adorable. She's also on the must protect list. We got three on the protect list so far. How many more will we have to protect? Ooh, uh, I wonder if we could drive it. I mean, that's a cool looking car though, let's be honest. I mean, I'm still, I'm still annoyed I failed that question, but oh well. Beep, beep. Wow, it's so fast! Yes. And it still manages to be such a smooth ride too. <laughs> I think I can see a little of why you're so proud of it, Van. I'd really start to cry if you couldn't. <laughs> we'll be out of the capital and on the northern highway in ten or so. Then I'll show you how fast and smooth my baby can really be. Oh, yes. It can go even faster? <laughs> Just try to keep it safe, please. Again, look at the background. How much more modern is Calvert? To I know it's different engines, obviously. They're, they're able to do more, but... Still, it makes Erebonia look super mid medieval time. We're actually leaving Edith. Ooh! Oh, I love these little moments. Oh, it brings you back to Cole Steel 1. Oh, I love it. We're actually leaving Edith. Ooh. Feels like the chapter's root. Oh my god, that's pretty. I mean, I got a screenshot of that. You know, how could I not? Still not sure you could have you should have come along for the ride, aren't you? I know you've got three days off, but a new term started. Didn't oh yeah, you're never in school. <laughs> what got? What you got no work to do? I just didn't want to be the only one left out. Oh, my darling. The Genesis seems to be involved in this somehow too. So it could be a, there's a role here that only I can play. And I applied for permission to be off campus for a few days last night. So don't worry, I'm not breaking any rules. 
You thought this through way too hard. <laughs> Aramis has always been way too lax with the rules for such a big name academy. Mm -hmm. Um, so if you're going to such a famous academy, why are you working for Mr. Arkwright here? Is it a part-time job? That's right. I only just started though, and I didn't have much say in them. <laughs> she just kind of let herself in, which is fine. Oh, and Farida, Van is fine. I'm getting paid for this. You're my client. No need to be polite. Uh, but okay, but only if you call me Fairy. Okay. Hmm? Sure, if that works for you. <laughs> Road trip. If you're 13, then you must attend Sunday school at the temple, right? Yeah, I just started senior classes this year. They're a lot harder than what I'm used to. Oh, but the temples here aren't the same as the ones I know, I think. As we know, well, at least she's getting education. Free didn't have one, did she? As we saw in Colsa 1, she just barely tried in school. <laughs> so, that's right, we have churches and chapels instead. But they serve the same purpose. But there are temples for worship in Calva too. We've got Arusha, the winged goddess in the central east, and Adios, the sky goddess in the west. They're believed to be one in the same, even if the names are different though. She's even got another name if you go farther east. Oh yeah, I did tell me about that. It feels like there's so much out there for me to learn. Hee <laughs> Dull. Still, it sounds like Ada taught you a lot. I wonder, if, I wonder if Ada will be a party member, that'd be cool. She did, not just about fighting, but about different places across the continent. What's popular in those places? I know this will sound weird after all that I've already asked you to find her, but I still can't believe her core would just disappear the way they did. They're all hardened Jaegers who have always been able to handle anything thrown their way. Your friend from the CRD called her the Flame Eater. Didn't he? Yeah, pretty well known name among Jaegers. They say she uses surgical precision with knives and gunfire to cut through enemy morale and momentum. She joined Ice and Shield five years ago and after her old core disbanded, I think. Zephyr. That sounds about right. She was in another core? She was. A really famous one really. too. <laughs> really famous. Hey, it the boys Zephyr are back. And was one of the two biggest Jaeger cores in the West. It was made up of a small number of combat specialists, the Jaeger, Jaeger King. King being its head. And Ida used to lead one of their units. Mm -hmm. But after the Jaeger King died five years ago, the whole core fell apart. That was when she moved on to Eisenshield. Yeah, oh, it's good to see him back. This is also interesting. I didn't realize Jaeger cores could have such rich history. <clears throat> Zephyr's still around, by the way, just in a different form. But yeah, they're right back in the day with someone else. Can't see someone who used to be with them going down easily. So you think so too? But if she's fine, then why does she make contact with the rest of her core? Ugh, all this is making my head hurt. But don't worry, we'll find her for you. That we will. Even if she isn't in Kriel, I'm sure we'll find some clue that will take us to her. Oh, are they so us lovely? how deep your bond with her goes. That alone will surely draw the two of you back together. Where there's a will, there's a way. And Van and I have the will to find you a way. I hope she stays this lovely. Doesn't get... Brutally destroyed by the story. You, you know mean I mean? it? Yeah. Well, thank you. I'll be counting on you both. <laughs> Aww, proud papa. Think about it. I know I've had some indirect involvement with Ada two years back. Ooh. No way. Were you part of? Was he part of reconciliation then? That'd be cool. That'd be a twist. You chose to go against her old home and help her help our side back then. Makes no sense that someone of her skill would up and vanish, and with a Genesis maybe involved. Ooh, that's a Grendel fight coming up, isn't there? Oh yes. There's gotta be more to this than there seems. The only question is whether she went dark by her own volition. Oh, if I, I, I missed the journey talky bits from Carl Steel One. It's nice I brought them back. Almost there, there, Jim. Wow. Road trip. Creel, this is so good. I must admit. Just, and it feels so different to the others. It's amazing. September 7th, 1125. Wow, the scenery here is beautiful. Everything's so green. You don't get a view like this anywhere I live. <laughs> oh, there isn't much like this near the capital either. We haven't passed another car in ages. It makes it feel like we have the whole picturesque view to ourselves. That's how it goes in an old country road. But we're making good time. Keep going like this, we'll be there in time for lunch. 
Now, if I was a passenger, we would have stopped 14 times for the toilet. That's why I hate car journeys. <laughs> oh, it's pain. Huh? Is something wrong, Van? Something's not right up ahead. Might be a kid, but you're not a Kruger warrior for nothing, huh? I'm gonna pull over. Be ready for a fight. Uh, all right. Already? Okay, then. Ooh. That's a lot of monsters. We are please say we could use fairy. That that house has been surrounded by monsters. Wolves, I count six, seven, eight. Bah, I hate working for free. <laughs> you can't say that. How can you stand by when there are people in danger? I know, aren't you? Are they? You should probably embrace it. I don't think this job is quite that nice. I know, I know. Watch yourself if you're gonna pitch in. You in or out, fairy? What do you think? Yeah. I'm in. Yay! We got another party member. Oh hell yeah! Someone with a gun. You love to see it. What is that? It's a rifle blade used in our core. You are like you. She's our feet. I'll use it to keep both of you safe. Now may Arusha watch over us. Hell yes. Okay then, let's do this. Ooh. Press R. Press R S to target enemy. Ooh. Okay, your damage is quite low, but I'll take it. Ooh. And then, I like that it didn't just force us into an eight-way fight. We can actually choose. And you're super quick. Okay, so what have you got then? Your fire. Fire and mirage, it looks like. Okay. Let's do this. Movement, strength, and... And you have an S-Craft. You'd love to see it. She's already amazing. Okay, so crit, she's got slow. Slow burn side attack bonus. Okay. Well, let's do that. Oh, wow. Hell yeah. I love it already. I love it a lot. And you're weak to RNA. You love to see it. I'll do that on you. Van. Hmm. You have no CP. Why do you have no CP, Van? Why is this? I don't know. Boom, boom. Oh god, yes. I was wondering when we were getting another party member. Is that other one gonna get a, do anything? Come on, Sai. Come on, Sai. Here we go. You love to see it. Job done. Oh, is that a chest? Oh, wait a minute. We're actually on the. Oh. I thought this was like a little tiny encounter. Oh, let's go get the chest then, right? Can I leave the area? Maybe? Oh my god, we can run up hills. <gasps> the future is awesome. This is... And also, thank you very much for coming to... For get... Oh, I know. Oh, that's cute. That's cute there. Thank you for the commenter for telling me to put the stick, the thing on, so I can see the chest, because that's very nice. And it's massive and obvious on the mini-map as well. I can't... Can I not? You're not, let... You're not letting me, are you? No. No, we're going to sideways run now. Okay. Fair enough. Well, this is pretty. They like... Wish we could fish though. Can I get you? That looks like a nice chest. Oh, I know. Bloody hell, that's, that was a nice chest. Thank you, Arne. I'm assuming I can't leave the area. Let's just have a little. <laughs> no, okay, fair enough. I thought I'd leave them to their own devices, but. Boom, 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 boom. So are you, is she classed as physical then? I'm going to assume she is. Aha, they're weaker to Arne. Okay, fair enough. They got a lot of health though, I would admit that. Oh well, time to die. Oh my god, I just realized there's a tactic screen. And we can change where they start in fights. How did I only just realize that's a thing? No, oh my god, ow. There we go. So that should make them all move, right? No, I guess is the answer to that. <laughs> oh well, time to die. And you're done. Oh no, you're not. Oh come on, I was gonna... Ow! Somebody's telling me. Anyway. Ow! That really almost killed... That was the wrong button. That almost killed very, very, very easily. <laughs> there we go. I mean, I assume she's like B, so she's going to be squishy, I assume. Until we level her up, at least. Boom. We did it, Legend. That was the last of them. Heh, not bad. I should use S-Cars more often, I know that. I already know how good Van is, but I'm amazed at how fast you are, Fairy. 
Are all warriors a Kruger like that? And no way, I'm still a rookie. Most of them are much better than me. And your arts were awesome, Arne. So is this your stuff? Oh, thank you. It's called an orbital stuff. And come on now. Wish I knew what was up with those two monsters. Those monsters, not them two. It was almost like, hello, you three over there. Oh, well, hello then. Are you okay? We really owe you one. We had to pull over because of the engine trouble. And next day we knew we were surrounded. I have to say, you've got some incredible combat skills. Oh, I know. What are you, braces? Nah, just ordinary passers-by. You work for Rescalva Transport, right? Let me give you my card. Arkwright Solutions? I'm just a guy who helps people with their problems. Not affiliated with the brace skill. <laughs> Even open the fighting monsters and stuff like I did just there. For a price. Wait. Um, Van? I hate to come across like this, but you would have been screwed without us, right? You could have charged them. <laughs> So if you could let your company know that and have them foot the bill, that'd be great. <laughs> what? But the police or guild would never... Well, we ain't cops or braces. And you can't keep the lights on with a thank you. Not trying to scam you here. I just want a fair price for our services. We'll even escort you to town to finish the job. Wouldn't imagine you're in a rush to get attacked again on the road, are you? Hmm, you got me there. Ugh, this is so inappropriate. <laughs> I can see where you're coming from, but I don't think it's inappropriate at all. Whether it's the water we drink or the security to see we're safe from harm, nothing in life is free. I suppose so. I wonder if everyone from Central East has such a practical mindset. Alright then, we'll hire you to take us down to Creel. And as soon as we arrive, I'll phone my balls. Sounds like a plan. Now come on you two, back in the truck. Okay. Oh, alright. Aw, oh, poor Arne. Oh, who's in there? Hmm. I wasn't expecting that to be how this ended. <gasps> We've seen you, right? You were on the trailer who was looked to be evil? Why are you taking the bus? That young man's most certainly caught my attention. I know, he is hot. Can't blame him. Ooh, the plot thickens. I should have upgraded um, Freya's stuff, right? Oh, well. Oh, it's off the... Oh, wow, that is pretty. That looks literally like a village, this village, like a minute away. It feels like I'm home. Fairy, not fairy. Well now, isn't this a lovely village? It's like an idyllic painting. Rolling hills amidst clear streams, a windmill turning with the wind, and a touch of Middle Ages architecture. Yeah, that literally looks like any village around here. That's so cool. <laughs> the white flowers we saw in the wheat field were beautiful as well. They were buckwheat flowers, weren't they? Good eye. Fun fact, the village uses them in their specialty dish, galette. Ooh. Oh, I've heard of those. Ida always says they make for a perfect lunch treat. <laughs> I'm excited to finally visit this place. This place is insanely picturesque. Aww. Anyway, that bus is going to be out of commission for a while, so why don't we grab some grub? Again, that just looks like any pub. This is... Look at the textures on that. I know it's less like, well, yeah, the textures. Big deal. But trails, that's massive. I hear the inn over there has the best food in the village. While we're chowing down, we can ask Ada's unit to drop by there. Sound good? Oh, man, I want beer and chips right now. Ooh, I want that so bad. Yep, yep. Then let's go inside, shall we? Wow. Okay, I thought we were going to walk around. Okay. <gasps> I'm trying to see what that is. Is that an egg? Wow, this egg is amazing, and the buckwheat has a pleasant fragrance as well. Even the side vegetables are delicious. Mmm. Mott -hmm. Mart has Creole's buckwheat too, but it's no surprise that it tastes even better here. Wait, they have orange and blackcurrant galettes on their menu? <gasps> Hell yeah, I'm ordering so ordering those. Oh, I think I'll do the same. I'll have some of those too. Um, maybe I'll order seconds. And birds. Sorry, I know it's very ill putting. But I have to voice that again. Sounds like you're all enjoying yourselves. Oh, hello. Ran. Galette are the pride of our village. No one makes them quite like us. So make sure you savour the flavour. And while you're at it, why don't you try some of the other items on the menu? We have vegetable galettes, smoked salmon and seasonal fruits. Oh, and you'll definitely want to try our dessert. We serve some of the best caramel ice cream you'll ever have. Wow, well, that's a decent pub. Uh, so many choices. Uh, is it bad that I want to order one of everything? You got caramel ice cream? I'll take 
10 of each. Bruh. Wait, hang on. We didn't come here to drown ourselves in food. We came to ask you some questions. You work here a lot, right? Of course. My parents own the place after all. You saved the people on that bus, right? Well, fire away then. I'll gladly answer any question you have. Cool. So I need you to think back to 10 days ago. Oh, it's so peaceful. Did any shady looking people happen to stop by here? 10 days ago? I don't know if I can remember that far. Wait, actually, yes, there was a group of Jaegers staying here around then. <gasps> Ooh, we found them. I knew it. If you don't mind me asking, how did you know they were Jaegers? Did their attire give it away? Oh no, they were wearing casual clothes. I just know a Jaeger when I see one. Our village is near the border of a few countries, so we get patrons like them from time to time. <laughs> But as long as they pay their bills and don't cause trouble, they're just as welcome here as any of our other guests. Gull. I suppose that's fair. This village is probably treated as a buffer zone between Jaegers. Braces are always buzzing around like flies, and there's a police station here. Wow, this village you everything. I've got a question for you. Was there a woman with that group of Jaegers? Yes, I remember there being one. I believe she was their leader. She had dark green hair tied back in a ponytail. She's alright, Ladyman. Honestly, I thought she looked really cool. Yep. That's Ada, all right. Sounds like we're on the right track. Do you know what happened to them after that? Like, did they say where they were headed, for example? Normally, I wouldn't share that kind of information out of respect for their privacy, but since you know them, I don't mind sharing what I know. They stayed here for one night and left the first thing in the morning. I don't know where they were going, though. I haven't seen them since. Wait, no. That isn't quite right. Ah, oh, dear. Huh? What do you mean? Have you seen one of them recently? Yes, I think so, actually. I'm pretty sure I saw that same woman three days ago. For real? Does that, mean, does that mean she's still in the village? I think that's doubtful, and honestly, it was only pretty dark out when I saw her, so I might have been wrong. I didn't see any of her Jaeger friends either. They could have all been destroyed, I mean. You know, the more I talk about it, the more I realise I could have been totally mistaken. Uh, sorry for getting your hopes up. Well, green hair, there was that lad on the bus, right? Don't be sorry, it's still a lead worth investigating. We should ask around town and see if someone else caught sight of her too. You've been a big help. I ordered one of those one of the sweeter galettes later as thanks. <laughs> I'll hold you to that. I won't pry into your business, but I do hope you enjoy your stay in our village. I will, it literally feels like I'm home. Looks so much like this place. Alright gang, it's info gathering time. Time for the rounds, Benjamin. I'm also, if you haven't told from the last episode, I'm cutting out a lot more of the random conversations i know some people like that but seems a lot of people don't because i can tell from this stuff so i'm cutting most of them out unless it's particularly interesting or funny or oh, my back so uh yeah let me know if you prefer it or not whatever <gasps> yes the goals to determine if aid really was here three days ago if luck's on our side we'll get some good information in no time fingers crossed all right let's get started shall we look at this my god it's like i'm in britain it's like i'm in Britain, in it, blighty. Wow. I would live here, and that's just yes, I would live here. Wow, and it's quite big. Ooh, yeah. See, this is why I'm going to cut out the random stuff because that could that easily adds like half an hour. All right, it doesn't feel like it when you're obviously recording it, but it's that's like half an hour of talk before we get to the main bit. So I'm going to try it out. Let me know what you think, and I'm going to end the episode here since we're literally in a village so next area so yeah i'll see you guys in the next one if you like what you saw feel free to like comment and for god's sake subscribe i've been on 49 and so close to 50 it makes me so happy ah yes i'm begging anyway yes i'll see you guys in the next one charles